Hey guys, I'm gonna try to be quiet because my kid's sleeping. It's 1.52. She's a light sleeper. I don't think it's so frustrating. Get up there. Go ahead. Let's see what comes out, shall we? Be an artist. Be a hermit. Very creative. You might like to just keep to yourself. Destroyer. <laughs> Child divine. Get down. Child wounded and serpent. Gambler. You might like to take chances, or you're dealing with someone who does. And you know when you're the student, you know, you're always a student or a teacher. You could be dealing with someone who's a student. Gossip could be. I said no. I said no. I said no. Spirit will teach you one way or another, like how to learn with like I'm picking up on this like aggravation, right? Patience. This kid. It's only that cat. It's it's really become a problem. And guys, I love animals. All right. It's this one cat. Just wants me to pat her all. The, only when I'm standing here, when I'm working. It's it's frustrating. Like I'm I'm an animal lover, but it makes me like mad. It's like this cat just doesn't listen. I'm learning to deal with it. It's a trigger, obviously, so I feel like it's specific. <laughs> Alright? Yes, uh, this is about lack or a feeling like you don't have enough of something or feeling left out of something. Money, financial, okay? There's a tower moment here. Look at the top blue off that. <laughs> oh. Alright. Look at the ace of wands. The Eight of Swords and the Ten of Wands. So you could be in, in your head um, and heavily burdened, right? Let's see in regards to magic. Okay. So something that you were left out of, there's a tower moment here for that. And it's bringing in a new beginning. I feel like some people are in, are in their head and burdened by this. Queen of Swords, we are um, air sign. Oh, this is you with your boundaries up. Um, you got a special connection with the divine. You know? Why is a gambler here? Maybe this is why someone took a chance and, and tried to leave you out of something financially. And um, I feel like you know about it. They, they may have done magic, manipulation, whatever this is, to keep you burdened, okay? Some of you may have even asked. 
I feel like this is just old news. Why is this coming up? It's been exposed. The, the past returns. Collaboration against you, okay? This could be the community. Excuse me, guys. I'm picking up on apologies. Maybe um, in regards to your home, your stability, okay, a house, housing, your platform, okay. Good news, someone's making some sort of decision, okay. This maybe do help you out financially. This could be an opportunity. This could be a choice you're going to have to make or about partnerships. And who to invest in, okay, when it comes to this online group or um, traveling, okay, or you, you have completed something, um, like a lesson, you've learned a lesson, and it's bringing in this Ten of Pentacles, all right? Um, I don't know what kind of I use. I just want to, like, close this out. Um... Archangel Michael. Uh, so, Ten of Pentacles, I feel like you just had to learn this lesson when it comes to finances and about certain people in your life. I feel like you took a lot of chances when it comes to your work. Alright? Child divine. Your healing. Just picking up on abuse. Um, I'm also picking up on a curse. Okay, this had to be, or this is a curse that had to be broken by doing the work. Generational. Okay, I feel like most of us know this, like, this is like the theme, you know. Um, honor and trust your feelings. You may want to journal. I hope you guys can hear me. Um, and focus on your health, okay. Your home is protected. The home is where the heart is, okay? This physical spot, this isn't, like, home. That's not what makes some place home, all right? I was thinking about this yesterday. I can make any place a home. It's about, all right? It's about your inner world. It says, forgive yourself. You've done nothing wrong. Major lessons, life lessons. And it has nothing to do with physical anything. It's internal. It affects our external. And that's how we manifest also. It gets deep. But I love you guys.